light and shadow shadow come out of your house in the morning and stand in the sunlight keep your back towards the rising sun you will see a long dark image on the ground in front of you this is your own shadow actually when an object comes in the way of light the light cannot pass through it and a shadow of that object is formed shadows are formed only in the presence of light shadows are always formed on the opposite side of the light source they move along with the objects the size of the shadow depends on the position of the light source you can check this by standing in the sunlight at different times of the day shadows are shortest at noon because at noon the sun shines overhead shadows are longer in the morning when the sun rises and in the evening when the sun sets light you can see things clearly during the day in sunlight but you cannot see anything in the dark suppose you are in a room at night and the light goes off can you see things in the room no you cannot see them as soon as the light comes back again all the things in the room are visible to you things are visible only when light falls on them when light falls on an object it bounces off and reaches our eyes thus we can see the things due to reflection of light on a dark night we often use a torch to see things the light from the torch falls on the things and it reflects back on our eyes and helps us to see the things